Welcome to a quick video on how to transfer our delegation from Ethereum mainnet to Arbitrum. So why might we want to do this? Well, if we delegated to an indexer in the past and that indexer has moved their operations from Ethereum mainnet to Arbitrum, for us to continue to receive delegation rewards, we should also transfer our GRT from Ethereum mainnet to Arbitrum. Arbitrum. So before we get into that, we need to see, has an indexer that we've delegated to in the past moved their operations from Ethereum mainnet to Arbitrum? Well, let's find out by starting at thegraph.com. And for this demonstration's purposes, I will be on testnet.thegraph.com, just as I put that in here. And this process is identical, regardless if you're using testnet GRT or actual GRT. So we'll start here by going to the delegation dashboard right there. And you'll see right on the top there, I got some notifications. Let's open that up. And bam, let's look at that second notification where I'm being told that, hey, an indexer that I delegated to in the past has moved their operations to Arbitrum and I could begin transferring my delegation. So we could go through this process right now, all the way through in transferring our delegation. However, I want us to know a few things before we begin this process that are important for the success of the transferring of our GRT. So there are two things that we should know before we transfer our delegation to Arbitrum. The first thing is that we need to be sure of our Arbitrum wallet address and then that we control that wallet. We need to make sure that this wallet address is accurate and that we can make transactions on this wallet because once we put that address into this transfer tool and submit, we cannot change that wallet address and your funds will be transferred to a wallet that we do not control. So we do not want to do that. And that's super duper important. The next thing is that we want to set aside 20 minutes to see our transfer all the way through. And just so you know, once we initiate this transfer, we must complete the transfer within seven days. This transfer typically takes around 20 minutes and there are one or two pop-ups that may come up that we have to manually usher this transfer through. If we do not complete the transfer within seven days, we lose our funds. So we must see this transfer through. Okay, let's see this transfer through. I'm gonna make the screen a little bigger here. There we go. And let's go through the steps. You can see the steps on the left. Initiate delegation transfer. That's what we'll do. Then we wait 20 minutes. We want to see this all the way through. It's best if we see this all the way through in case any pop-ups come up that we have to manage. And then we'll confirm delegation transfer. You can see on the right, the current wallet. That is the same wallet that we are logged in on right there, the BCF2, BCF2. And then it's also the same wallet that will auto-populate to the receiving address. This is the one that you can input. Just make sure that you're 100% sure that you control this wallet, be it a, a EOA or a multi-sig. Let's initiate the transfer. Click here, confirm, wait for this to go through. Okay, transfer initiated. There we go. The 20 minute timer is going on. I'm going to uh, go ahead and fast forward this so it can finish and I'll see you on the other side. Okay, our delegation was transferred successfully. If we see anything pop up on the left, any more instructions, go ahead and follow those instructions through. Some transactions may need to be ushered through with another uh, operation within the transfer tool in case gas prices spike. Uh, however, we did not see that right now, which is great. Any other instructions on the left, you'll see, just follow those through. That's why it's helpful to wait the full 20 minutes on this process just to make this transaction through. And to confirm this, you want to pull up Arbitrum Gurley to see the transaction all the way through. And I'll pull that up right now. There we go. We can see the transaction was made there. So thank you so much for your time on this L2 transfer tooling video. I appreciate you bringing your delegation onto Arbitrum, and I look forward to seeing you in the graph ecosystem soon. Take care.